Hey guys, this is me, Samuel Morris from IPTVSenpai.com, and in this video I'll be discussing some of the features of, according to me, the best IPTV player right now, TV Mate. I've tried out dozens of IPTV players over the years, but honestly, TV Mate is the one I always come back to. It's made specifically for big screens, and when it comes to Android TV, Fire Stick, or pretty much any device, it's hands down the best choice. What sets TV Mate apart for me is the interface. It's got that real TV guide feel to it, and it's super fast, customizable, and easy to navigate with a remote. Now, the free version is pretty limited, but the premium plan unlocks some seriously awesome features like recording, multi-screen, and so much more. I've been using the lifetime option for years, and I am pretty satisfied. So what we need to understand is that TV Mate doesn't give you any channels. It just connects to your existing IPTV service like Strong 8K or Eagle 4K given by your provider. All right, so before we get into all the awesome features of TV Mate, I'll quickly walk you through the installation process for those of you who might not know how to get it set up. I'll be using a Fire Stick device, but the process is pretty much the same on Android devices as well. You have to go to the Downloader app and enter my short code 5546232. Once you are redirected to my website, you can then find the TV Mate app and install it from there. This is the first screen you see. You'll have to click on Add Playlist, and then select from one of these three options, which will be provided to you by your IPTV service provider. So, this actually is the premium version. Here you can see all the available channels that you have access to. You can easily navigate the app with the up and down button on your remote if you're using a Fire Stick device like me. Let's start with some of the basic features first. If you long press the Select button on your remote, you'll get to this option menu. From here, you can easily add any channel to your favorites for easy access. Now press the left button, and here you'll see the Favorites tab, where you'll get all those channels in the list. Now if you want to add an external player for VOD content, or for simply reduced buffering, then you'll need to press the left button, and then select All Channels, and then click on Use External Players, and then Yes. This will integrate the external player like MX Player, if you have downloaded on your device. Similarly, you can also change the app language with the one you're comfortable with. Head over to Settings, then select Appearance, and then Language. Here you'll have the option to choose from multiple languages. The next one is one of my personal favorites. So imagine you have two different live sports going on. This is how you can watch both of them at the same time. From the options, select Multi-View. Here you'll be able to watch multiple channels simultaneously. But note, you'll only be able to do this if you have multiple connections on your account. There is also this great feature of picture-in-picture. Picture. When we turn it on, it allows us to keep the channel screen open in a small floating window, so you can continue watching while navigating through other parts of the app or using other apps on your device. If you have kids, then you can turn on the parental control feature from settings. As always, it lets you restrict access to certain channels or content, ensuring that only age-appropriate material is available for viewing. Okay, so I'm sure most of you will love this next feature. The premium version of TV Mate also offers a recording option, allowing you to easily record anything. If you select one of the channels, you'll see an option to record. If you're recording a show, you can still watch something else on another channel, but only if you have multiple IPTV subscriptions or playlists. It is only possible to view the recordings on an external player like MX Player, as I showed you earlier. If you've missed the latest shows or sports, you can watch them again with the catch-up feature on TV Mate. However, availability typically depends on your IPTV provider. Open any channel and then press these buttons one by one. The menu button, left button, and then right button. Dates will show up. You can easily scroll through and find the live show you've missed. You can even add multiple playlists from different providers by going to Settings, then Playlists, and then all the way down to Add Playlists. Here you'll see, just as in the beginning of the video, we added a playlist. You can do that again to use features like multi-view that we talked about, or have entirely different channels in two different playlists. One of the most common complaints people have with IPTV players is frequent buffering. The good news is there's a solution for that, adjusting the buffer size. The buffer size determines how much video needs to be downloaded before playback starts. If you're experiencing frequent buffering while switching channels, try increasing the buffer size to improve the streaming experience. Updating EPG manually is another great feature to use. 
EPG gives you a clear, easy-to-read schedule of upcoming programs, allowing you to quickly browse and select shows, movies, or sports events based on their airtime. You can update it by going to Settings, then selecting EPG, and then Update EPG manually. Make sure your IPTV provider includes a working EPG URL in your package. This refreshes the schedule of TV programs and events to help you keep up to date so you can easily plan what to watch without missing anything. And finally, one of the many features of TiviMate includes managing and customizing channel groups. So what we do is long press the channel category where we'll find options such as show favorite channels only, use an external player for the category, EPG time offset, or even hide the group completely. You can limit the number of available channels with TVMate on a single playlist by hiding groups you don't want to appear, or adding your preferred groups or channels to favorites, then choosing to show only favorites option to limit the channel list. So these were some of the many features that we find mostly on TVMate and not other players, which I think is the best IPTV player right now. Before you go, make sure to visit my website IPTV Senpai for more in-depth guides, expert reviews, and the latest updates on streaming and IPTV services. Also subscribe to my YouTube channel for the latest tips, reviews, and IPTV streaming guides.